Our second graders built a foldable box that contained objects that represent who they are. Instead of calling it a jack-in-the-box, students add their own names to it. For example, my box would be called David in the Box. This project incorporated social studies, engineering, science, and mathematics. In their social studies periods with their homeroom teachers, students learned about self-identity, their own unique characteristics, and the similarities and differences between themselves and others. For engineering with Jim McLaughlin, students use their knowledge of self-identity to create an object that represents who they are as a person, using the design thinking process. They also use their science knowledge and skills to describe and classify the materials they use to create their objects by their observable properties. In design class, Becca Guess and I helped students build and design their foldable boxes. We first had them learn about measurements to gain an understanding of the size and dimensions of their box. They then learned how to use box cutters to score foam board, a technique where you cut only a certain percentage of the board. For example, when you score 100%, that means you cut right through the board. When you score 50% of the board, you are only cutting halfway. Students learned how to score so that they can make their board fold. We gave each student a full foam board and had them make the appropriate cuts. Then fold their board into a box, glue it all together and then finally decorate the boxes with pictures that represent their self-identity. Thanks for watching, please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this.